Jackson County Fuel Committee, and we've been working with Occupy. One of the projects that um, uh, they've helped us with is our wood cuts. We cut and distribute wood free of charge to low income families in need in Jackson County. And it's been cold, and we need help. We need wood, we need trucks and chainsaws and splitting malls and people to, to uh, operate them. Every Saturday and Wednesday, uh, we've got more requests than we can deal with from you know families that are going cold here in Jackson County. So anybody who's interested in that can talk to me afterwards. Uh, we're also fighting the utility companies. We've got a couple of petition campaigns to put in moratoriums on shutting off low-income households during the winter. Both in the city of Ashland, now we're petitioning the state public utilities commission. We're also trying to repeal the 15% rate increase we gave Pacific Power this year, owned by the second richest guy in the country, who extracted more than $200 million in profit from the people of Oregon. $39 out of Pacific Power bill is pure profit for Pacific Power. So we need volunteers to help with the petition campaign and with the fighting the utility advocacy cases. We had five in this week. Um, lastly, we've got a, a film that we're showing at the Center for Creative Change in Ashland tonight. It's called Home. It's been viewed by 400 million people worldwide. Hardly anybody in the United States has seen it because the creator insists on showing it for free. It shows uh, the planet and what's happening to it. And it's a call to action. What do we need to do to save our planet? We only have so much time left. So everybody's welcome to come to that. There's a vegetarian potluck at 6. I've got leaflets for it. I put the flyer on the table there. Thank you. Center for Creative Change, 2nd in Maine in downtown Ashland, 6 o'clock tonight.